My name is Paul Smith. I'm a postdoctoral researcher here at Chagas Grange, looking at strategies to reduce methane emissions in beef cattle. Methane is a potent greenhouse gas that is 28 times more potent to the environment than carbon dioxide. When we look at agricultural greenhouse gas emissions, methane produced by ruminant livestock accounts for over 60% of our methane emissions of our agricultural greenhouse gas emissions. Therefore, reducing methane emissions will be key for the sector to meet its 2030 objectives to reduce emissions by 22 to 30%. When it comes to measuring methane emissions, we use a piece of equipment like this, which is called the green feed system. The way the green feed system works, an individual animal, when they're out at pasture, is enticed to use the, uh, the system by a bait feed that is in, contained within the green feed system. The animal will approach the, the piece of equipment, put their head inside the feed bin here. The machine will then identify each animal and begin to drop the bait feed. And while the animal is consuming the bait feed, um, an extractor fan up the top of the unit will circulate and collect all the emissions that the animal has been produced and bring it into the unit where there's a computer inside with a bunch of sensors that are able to calculate the amount of methane in which each animal uses. Um, so ongoing research here in Chagas Grange is looking at a variety of different ways to, produce, to reduce methane emissions in beef cattle. So we're looking at ways of supplementing animals with methane suppressing compounds such as dietary lipids, Trinop or Bovier as it's commercially known, uh, looking at the role of halides and indeed seaweeds to potentially reduce methane emissions in beef cattle. We are also looking at ways of breeding more efficient animals, so animals that basically produce more less methane over their lifetime, and this is in conjunction with work that's carry, being carried out with the Irish Cattle Breeding Federation. Uh, we're also looking at ways of improving pasture, so the role of potentially white clover and indeed multi-species swords to reduce the amount of methane and indeed hopefully increase the productivity of animals to lead to a reduction in the amount of methane the animal produces over its lifetime.